Okay, and as you can see, and you want to pick split layer, and as you can see, if you pay attention to the timeline, it separates. So as you guys can see, What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new video, it's Monday and today actually guys, um, I'm going to start advertising, you know, a Nitro Energy drink because you guys may know that I released a video, I think, uh, a few a few days ago that, you know, Nitro will, will sponsor all the videos. That is what you guys are going to see the upcoming, I don't know, how many videos. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use jump cuts. So, as you guys know, I'll, even in this intro, I use jump cuts and I will show you guys how to do them, how to apply them and when not to apply them. So, I would say let's jump straight into the video. Okay guys, so as you guys can see, we landed on uh, After Effects and basically what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you guys how to clip, you know, how to cut a clip, then cut to, to something else. So I dragged in already my video, so I'm going to drag that one into my timeline. As you can see, I'm just, I'm just opening the can, I'm just opening the can as you can see. First of all, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to um, piss, pick, <laughs> piss. No, I'm going to pick a specific, you know, position in this video, in this clip, and then I'm going to cut it. And what I'm going to do then is I'm going to cut and then, you know, like pick another part of the video and put it together. So it jumps like to another cut. That's that's why what that's why it's called jump cut. So as you guys can see, I'm just opening opening the can as you can see right here. And uh, basically the next thing, let's say I'm going out, I want to cut it like right here. As you guys can see, I'm just going to zoom in a little bit in the timeline. So what I'm going to do now is I just want to say like, okay, I want to cut from here. Well, it's really simple. You just want to go to edit at the top as you can see and you want to pick split layer and as you can see if you pay attention to the timeline it separates so as you guys can see um, this is just separated and I can move it you know from each other so when I play the video back it's going to look like this so I'm just having the can and then it cuts to black so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to shorten in the clip as you can see so I'm gonna drag this one to the right like this boom so it cuts to another part of the video so let's say I just want to start you know the cut from here right there so what I did I just decide okay I'm going to cut to this specific part so as you guys can see I did cut to it and what I'm going to do now is when I you know cut from this I'm going to put the other layer like I can you can drag this like if you say like I want to clip to start like right here you can do that but I'm going to you know put it like here that's like that that's big enough the space between it. And then I'm going to just drag that on top, well, until it touches, you know, the previous one. So it cuts to that scene. So this is how it, this is how it looks. As you guys can see, so it cuts right away from, you know, looking down with my can uh, like this. And then I'm just cutting to, you know, drinking. So I'm going to show you guys right now. When it looks in total, we'll just see what happens. Because I don't know why it plays in slow motion. Don't ask me why. I mean, I use Sony Vegas for editing all my videos. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to play back the video. And as you guys can see, I cut from looking down with my can to drinking it. So as you guys can see, this is what I made of it. And this is basically a jump cut. So let's see how it looks in total when everything is run it out. So let's see how, what we have so far. As you guys can see, I just cut from here. And if I play back the video, um, it will cut like when I'm drinking. So let's see how it looks right now. Boom, That's the, that, that is a jump cut, as you can see right there. Boom. So that is basically a jump cut, guys. That is so simple as this is just, you know, I'm not going to show you guys how to edit an entire video because I don't know, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense to me. Like, dude, why are you going to bore us with 10 minutes? Like how to add like an entire video. I'm just like, dude, this is like one example um, that you can use to edit your entire video. And that's basically all, all I'm saying. See what we have again, what we have in total. Boom. That's what we have. There's nothing more to tell you guys and to show you guys and explain because that is how it how is. You just want to, you know, choose a point. You want to split the layer and then you want to cut it from, you know, and then you want to drag it and then put the pieces to it, like together, like as you can see right here, like like they're together, and then it it cuts, it jumps to another cut. So that's how simple it is. There's nothing more to tell you guys. Yeah, that's basically how simple it is. That's how simple it is, guys. That is how you use jump cuts. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank, thank you guys for the continued support. I will see you guys tomorrow for two new videos of OBS. So I want to see you guys tomorrow for two new OBS tutorials. So I want to thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow for two new videos. You know, same time, same channel. Yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow.
in about uh, four episodes. It's gonna be the 22nd of May and then I find something else. When I started using video editing software, it was like, I have my own Patreon page. You have fucking troll. Channelpages.com. Kinda nice weather. And I'm a tight with just Alex Halford. You know, yes. it's his channel, so that's a bit of a logic.